You and A's get you and your boy time back here with another video and in this video today guys we're going to be doing a gameplay of the Ruby and Nicholas Claxton in NBA 2K24, my team. Now, you do have a 25% chance to pull him. If you do get this pre present meets future, uh, if you get this whole set done, it, uh, it is super easy. All these agendas, four of them should be able to get them done in like 25, 30 minutes. Or you can pick up Nicholas Claxton directly via the player market for 10,000 MT. 6'11", 215 pounds, 88 three ball, 96 block, 90 steel, great interior, good speed, good lateral quickness, badge wise, really solid as well. Now, the one thing I would recommend if you are going to run Nicholas Claxton is to give him catch and shoot. The rest of the badges, I don't really care about, but he at least needs a catch and shoot to make him that next level good. Now, I've used Nicholas Claxton already a little bit. His release feels a little bit baited in gameplay, but it feels really easy to time and really easy to green. Looking at Mr. Claxton here in shoot round, no hot spots, and release in this shoot around looks okay, but I'm telling you guys, in gameplay, it is that little bit slow. So you have to be literally wide open to get this wind up release off. But I will say just the threat of his shooting ability matters more than you guys know. Having a stretch big and making sure the defense respects it is, is, is important because if a defense doesn't have to worry about a stretch big, it just makes things so much tougher offensively. Meanwhile, Claxton still defensively is going to be really solid. If you look at his stats, badges defensively, that alone makes the card really solid as it stands. High three ball, outside of that offensively, doesn't give you a whole ton. But if he could just be a stretch big, I think, I mean, people are at least going to have to respect him. As far as the dribble six, everything else like that, I mean, look, he's Nicholas Claxton. His movement is going to be absolutely horrible. My opponent, 41 and 28. But if there's one thing I learned today, man, records don't mean anything. Because I just, I lost to a guy that really had a bad record not that long ago. So I'm, I'm going to absolutely sweat this guy from the beginning of this game onward. That's tough. Board Giannis, I need a wasn't even in the right position there to get that board. Come on, Clax. Good. Good patience. Nicholas Claxton, the threat of his three-point prowess, makes him close out. Claxton finds himself wide open and he gonna do the rest. Green, good debug, good debug, come on. Claxton with his second assist of the game. Straight up, Clax, good. Yeah, Claxton. Like. Throwing himself out the play and I threw it. He was gonna throw himself out the play because he was mad and I just threw it. Like, what am I doing today? I do not know. You better stop leaving Claxton though. Claxton on the pop has it going on right now. Let's get that badge activated. Good Clax. Good Clax. Good, Clax. He making every right play thus far offensively. Clax, take off. I knew Clax that would be able to shoot, but I, 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 maybe it's just me. But I expected his defense to be just a little more. And offensively, I didn't expect him to be able to do all this. Like. Attack the rim? Like, I ain't expect all this. Good. Relax! There you go! Protect the rim, big fella! Thank you, man! Got him. One more. Great offense. Great offense. Great offense. Look at Claxton protecting my cup. Thank you. Good 
Debug Green. Debug Green. Who got hurt? Yo, Ron Artest. What are we doing, big bro? Claxton just making every right play. 10 points and 5 assists? I mean, come on, man. The 5 assists is crazy for Nicholas Claxton. Oh, what? Oh, my gosh. Claxton! Oh, my gosh! He snatched it! Hey, Claxton! He snatched it! Yo, Claxton, man. Come on, man. We not supposed to be doing all this. Swing. Hey, Iggy. And one! And one, Iggy. I know it's green. I'm already knowing it's green. Claxton makes the pass, and it seems like whenever Claxton makes the pass this far, it's green. Not on Claxton, are you crazy? Nah, he must be crazy. Ah, God, he tired. That's why he getting bad annies. He tired. They barely played the first half. They should not be getting hurt yet. Man, he is exhausted. Of course he's going to miss because he's so tired, man. Halftime box score is probably all Claxton's going to play. 10.7 assists, 3 rebounds, 3 blocks. I can't ask for more. Shout out my opponent, one of the coolest guys after the game, too. We played a close competitive game. Claxton obviously sat most, uh, all of the second half. But shout out my opponent, man. People like that, the reason I do what I do, man. Claxton, 10, 3, 7, and 3 blocks all in the first half was super good. Newsflash, guys, when it comes to budget centers in my team, it doesn't get much better than Nicholas Claxton. Now, is his release great? No, I'm not going to sit here and sugarcoat things. I'm not a fan of that release. It's too slow. It is easy to green when you do get a good look, but uh, definitely too slow. Outside of that, though, man, he is the real deal in my team. Gets you paint stabs, can attack the rim a little bit. And just overall, as a budget big in my team, does not get much better. Like, if you're comparing him to the Ami AD, give me Claxton. If you're comparing him to Ami Jaren, give me Claxton. Still obviously taking, like, the Diamond Bosch over Claxton, but I do really like, as far as an overall card in my team, what he provides for you guys on the court. I am a big, big fan of Nicholas Claxton. Drop a like on the video, guys. Subscribe if you are doing it. As always, man, I love you guys. Have a blessed day.